I'm uh, Mia, uh, Partners and Pathways for uh, NATAP. So I lead the channel organization, distribution and alliances for NATAP across Middle East and Africa. Fantastic. Now, now there's a lot of things happening in storage, right? And data storage, data management, storage management. One is, of course, the, the demands of uh, the new use cases, like you know, the connected car and the autonomous uh, use yeah. cases, applications, putting pressure on the storage vendors to get fast storage, fast data. How are you, and of course the analytics and all that. How is this impacting your portfolio of solutions? Yeah, of course, I like this question a lot, Aaron, thank you. Uh, did you have the chance to visit our booth? So what we're displaying today is uh, with our partnership Ducati. Uh, what is Ducati? It's not just a motorbike that we are displaying in there. So actually that motorbike has 60 sensors and they are connected. And this is what we call data connected. I.e. what we are having here is an HCI uh, 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 solution which is connected to the cloud and our uh, Ducati as a customer is leveraging on simplifying and using their data, managing their data to really uh, not only uh, be number one in the races, but to, to be able to scale and be faster in everything they do. So proper data management solution connected. That's one of our use cases and we are showing it today in Jitex. But as well, um, I mean, uh, uh, we're not anymore the storage vendor. So we are more of, uh, if you would want to say, data management offering. And as you know, Aaron, we have our data fabric, which is not only today as a data management solution, but if you look at Gartner and uh, all analysts today, they look at it as one of the main solutions more than it is data management. Okay, fantastic. But let's look at the, uh, the buzzword AI, artificial intelligence, yeah. right? Machine learning. Have you brought out any specific solutions yeah. Are there software solutions to make this move faster, the adoption of new use cases? As well, part of Jitex today, we have uh, NVIDIA with us as a main sponsor. Uh, this is to strengthen our message to the market on what we are doing from AI perspective. What we are doing basically is our on-top AI architecture. It's supported by the NVIDIA DGXs to provide the real uh, easy way of uh, managing and benefiting from the data of the businesses today. So that's the main thing. And uh, not only that, from AI perspective, and I can speak from channel perspective, uh, what we're doing, we're uh, uh, aligning our uh, partnership with NVIDIA much better, stronger, and through our distributors as well in this market, really to leverage on uh, creating opportunities, not only from the compute layer, but as well creating the need for managing the data and not only storing the data, making sure that it is futurely connected to the cloud as well. Yeah, so this is obviously a highly technical subject, but I'm very interested to see how NetApp is taking these solutions to the market. So obviously there is a demand from the end user, there are specialized channel partners, yeah. Which is the best way to ensure there's good velocity in the channel for AI mm -hmm. solutions to go on? That is, you know, AI is deep learning and to understand how you manage this data from deep learning, it is very important to have the scientists. And not every single partner in the market can have these scientists because, you know, firstly, they are costly because, second, it's difficult to find them in such a market. So the best way, what we try to do, with our distributor, for example, Ingram, we have the data scientists that they sit here in Dubai and they can facilitate this as a service for our partners. In parallel, what we did, we have signed some joint partners along with NVIDIA to make sure that we are building our pipeline and being the leaders and uh, the first to penetrate this market. You know, especially UAE is, uh, I would say, in the Middle East is number one. Uh, country to, to start the practice of AI. Now we all speak about it. Channel initiatives which need to be taken to ensure these solutions are made available to the channel partners. Is yeah. there any specialized training? Is there any yes, of course. We have the right proper roadmap and this is one of the solutions that NetApp today is pushing uh, its partners to deliver more. And uh, for that, we have a specific enablement roadmap 
uh, and uh, not, we're not only giving the partners that roadmap and just follow these trainings, we're giving them um, an opportunity to learn more about our ONTAP. Our ONTAP is, uh, if I would say, the, the main uh, success for uh, NATAP, which is ONTAP specialized for AI. So now the partner would be able to provide service as well for, uh, for his customer. Aligning, of course, when, with NVIDIA. So we're helping our partners from NATAP perspective to grow their business. And it's not anymore the same old story like uh, just go and sell storage or uh, go and uh, sell cloud. We really want to be the advisor for our partners, making sure that they understand the difference in uh, uh, the solutions that they're providing. AI is one of them. I would say enterprise solutions is another one. DevOps is the third one. And cloud is, of course, one of the main solutions we are helping our uh, partners to develop their expertise on. Any other innovations happening in the product portfolio in terms of storage, data management? Now, we're, what we're taking as uh, the main story, if you want, or the main message is our data fabric. Of course, here you have uh, maybe uh, lots of uh, things come up. Uh, some of the newest things, I would say, we align and we're growing our alliances. On the cloud, as you know, we have Microsoft, we have AWS and Google, and we're strengthening our partnership with every one of them, as well on, um, if I would say, uh, backup and data recovery, we have uh, strengthening our alliances, for example, with Veeam, with Commvault, and uh, lately with Rubrik as well. So uh, you would see us really uh, thinking from a perspective being more of a solution advisor to our partners and making them be as well the solution advisors for their customers, benefiting from aligning as well with our strengths alliances that we have in the market. Your leadership for the channel the loyalty programs, the incentives, the rebate programs, what is happening over there? Yeah, um, very nice uh, change happened just uh, two quarters ago. Um, we care about our partners and we always had the really very nice rebates programs in place. Uh, but uh, we look always for simplifying things. And uh, last year we felt like a little bit uh, claiming it's, uh, it's another claiming these rebates. So we came up uh, this year with a claimless uh, kind of rebates where automatically when the partner sell, he can of course uh, get his money end of the quarter. And this is something of a great benefit and partners are loving it. So I'm sure that uh, the demand for data and storage is continuing quite steadily, right? And the partners are still having good incentives and uh, programs. What is the, how is the market uh, situation? Um, you know partners, they look for profitability and they want to work with the vendor that uh, provide them with that uh, profitability. This is why we look at not only focusing on the, I would say, uh, upfront margin for the partners and uh, squeezing them, or we focus more on providing them with the right incentives, with the right rebates. And actually what, uh, what we did, not only from NetApp, and this is part of my strategy, through my distributors we have as well some programs that tops our programs to maximize the profitability. So really with NetApp, a partner can enjoy uh, uh, very good uh, profitability upfront and uh, from incentives and rebates. So.